much has changed since the last Mortal Kombat tournament. Dark forces of Outworld have begun invading the Earth realm. These attacks are seriously weakening Earth's dimensional fabric, enabling not only Outworlders to enter the Earth realm, but warriors from other domains as well. Only the most extraordinary warriors could possibly meet this challenge. Liu Kang, Princess Kitana, Sub-Zero, Jax, Sonya Blade, Nightwolf, Kiva, Curtis Stryker, Driven by purpose and bound by honor, these are the defenders of the realm. the Earth Realm. I paid for my mistakes with my life. No one can fathom the damnation I have been through. For years, you have kept my soul trapped in a tortured inferno. Remember it well, for if you fail me again, you will spend eternity there. But I am willing to give you one last chance to prove yourself worthy. I have gained possession of a force that is so great, it will give me ultimate power and reduce even Raiden to a mere mortal. Behold, the orb. This is only a minute taste of the orb's power. It is infinite. Whoever possesses the orb has the key to control the very elements of Earth Realm. Fire, wind, water, earth, and that includes Raiden's powers. Most extraordinary. But what has this to do with me? We have learned that the more innately evil the possessor, the more intense is the power of the orb. Few have ever existed more malevolent than you, Shang Tsung. Indeed. So, what is your plan? First, I will send warriors into Earthrealm to lure out Raiden's minions. Then, when you surprise them with the power of the orb, they will never know what hit them. Raiden will have no choice but to come forward to defend his pathetic mortals, but the orb will render the god of thunder powerless. This is true. Once Raiden and his minions are wiped out, you will return to Outworld with the news. Then I will send a mighty army to conquer the Earth realm. I am honored to carry out your commands, Great Emperor. If you fail me again, you will be banished to the Void. For eternity. I will gladly take my revenge on Raven and his minions before I destroy the Emperor Shao Kahn. Then I will rule out the world and the Earth realm!
Hey, Raiden, be sure you don't get your feet wet while everyone else is working. How would you like to eat that tool? <laughs> Give it your best shot, girlfriend. Hey, you okay, man? You don't look too good. You know, Jax is right. Is something wrong, Raiden? No, oh, I'm I'm fine. Just get back to work. I'm not buying it, big guy. You hiding something. Take a break. I need you all in the main chamber now. What's up? We didn't hear the combat alert. That's because there isn't a rip. But there is an irregularity. It's not in the Earth's dimensional fabric, it's in the elemental pattern. What's that mean? Well, I'll try and show you. There are bizarre environmental disasters unfolding all around the Earth realm. Severe quakes in areas with no known faults. Floods in the desert. Tornadoes, hurricanes, the list goes on. That is unbelievable. But this isn't a runaway greenhouse effect. It's as if someone was messing with Mother Nature herself. I mean, let me show you some more of what's happened. This phenomenon is connected to you somehow, isn't it? Come on, I'm not challenging you, man. I'm, I'm genuinely concerned. Something is interfering with my powers. Combat alert! We've got a rip! Wait, guys. I, I, I can't go. I'm not feeling right. Why, why don't you leave me a dragon jet and I'll join you if, if I pull it together? You're gonna be okay? Yeah, yeah, it's probably nothing. I'll cover base. I'll go in Jack's place. Come on, Kiva. All right, let's, Hurry, go. let's go. Let's go. All right, time to fess up. What's going on? Whatever is messing with the elemental pattern is somehow affecting me. My powers are acting very strange. Qualify strange. I feel like I'm losing my powers. Happy? Hey, I'm on your side. But how are we going to handle this? Look, I'm not a stranger to being powerless. You know, in Outworld, I have no power. But this is Earth, where I draw my greatest strength. Something is definitely interfering with nature. You mean you could actually end up a mortal butt like the rest of us? I'm sorry, sorry, man. You really are in major trouble. The Emperor has resurrected me. I have waited a long time to take my revenge on you, Liu Kang. I am ready to meet the challenge. I defeated you in the Mortal Kombat tournament. I can certainly do it again. This time, you cannot win. Now run, weaklings. Run from the new master of your realm.
Grab hold! It is a miracle we are all still alive. Well, we won't be for long in this blistering heat. Your fate rests in Raiden's hands. Having defeated Liu Kang, I have had a taste of vengeance. Tell Raiden that unless he comes, I will close the fissure and crush the life out of you. We will be ready for you, Raiden. So that's our status. We're in over our heads. I can't believe Shang was able to do this to you. This isn't the same Shang Tsung. He has an orb that seems to control all the powers of nature. I'm not sure what you can do, Raiden, but Sub-Zero is really suffering. None of us can take this intense heat for too much longer. Well, I can't wait to see Raiden blow Shang away with a few well-placed bolts. Telling them could definitely spoil the rest of their day. Inform Shang Tsung that I'm coming. I hope I won't have to get used to this painfully slow method of transport. Ah, uh -huh, very funny. <laughs> Listen, Raiden, considering we may not make it out of this alive, how about answering a personal question? Honestly. Ah, uh, why not? If we do survive, no one will ever believe I actually confided in you. <laughs> right. <laughs> so tell me, why did you decide to stick around Earth Realm with all this warring going on? And as a god, you could have chosen almost any realm. The truth is, I have become connected to the very essence of this unique emerald planet, with its amazing diversity of life. As you know, I draw my power from one of its many natural wonders. Earth Realm possesses great power, but it is also remarkably fragile. Too few mortals realize that over a hundred species perish from the planet every day. Man, that's unreal. Yes, but true. In my soul, I feel the people of this realm are good. They do care what happens. You could say that I believe in humanity, the power of the human spirit. It can be the most amazing force imaginable. Plus, I've always been a sucker for the underdog. So, girlfriend, if we're doing true confessions, it's your turn. Why have you given up a relatively normal life for one of constant struggle and sacrifice? I guess I really love this place, too. I know if we let the other realms take over, Earth will be totally thrashed. So, I keep fighting. <laughs> what? Oh, it's ironic. Now I've been reduced to one of the underdogs. Hey, man. Being mortal doesn't mean being a wimp. Don't forget, our little band of mortals has pulled off some amazing stuff. Oh, I assure you, even without my special powers, I'm ten times the combatant of any of you. I have, after all, thousands of years more experience. Oh, yeah, and you modest, too. <laughs> Look, if you're gonna face Shang as a mortal, let me give you some advice for a change. There are times when we're up against so much, I don't think I can go on. But then I join forces with the others, and working together, we pull off miracles. I have no doubt I can easily defeat Shang Tsung. But unfortunately, it is this strange orb I am truly up against. I'm not sure the best of... What was that? Nature's power in the wrong hands. Didn't sound good. I hope they're okay, or we're all cooked. You're all mine now, Raven. Looking for me? A little nervous, Shang? You cannot hide from me. 
I challenge you to mortal combat. Accept it. Have a taste of your own, lightning god. Escape me! Uh, boy, Raiden, just buy me a few more minutes. Jack, yes. oh, yes. hey, he's here. I can't make it. Too hot. I'll get you out. Watch me squeeze the life out of your precious mortals! Hurry! He's on to us! Now, Shang, let's see how you do without nature backing you up. You're nothing without your powers! Oh my, it appears I've gotten them back. Tell you what, though, I won't even use my special talents. I'm gonna kick your sorry tail mortal style. Better idea. I'm going to let the Emperor deal with you. No! I suspect that things didn't turn out the way Shao Kahn had planned. His revenge on Shang should be brutal. It's good to have you back to normal. Not that I enjoyed being blasted around, but I did benefit from the experience. It proved, as I have always believed, that mortals can accomplish amazing feats. You said it. We just gotta get in there and dig it up. You guys are actually acting like friends? You kidding? Me and Thunderlips? <laughs> no chance. Sea Slug would have been with your company. That's more like it. All the power of nature in a single orb. It seems like once it was out of evil hands, everything returned to normal. Essentially, the orb is not evil. Like nature herself, it just is. The orb was driven to evil by Shang. What are you going to do with it now? Nature is perfection. When she is left to her own devices. This orb possesses far too much power. We can't risk it ever falling into corrupt hands again. Where did you send the orb? Into space, where it should be safe from evil.